What's going on everybody? Welcome back. Thank you for watching. Today's video is one that a lot of you guys have been asking to see. This might be the most requests I've ever got for a video in the comments, honestly. So a few weeks ago, we tested the spicy 12 gauge shotgun slug, as I call it, on a zombie head. And it was absurd. There was literally nothing left. So in the comments, a lot of you suggested that we get a torso and try it on that. Since the torso is bigger, maybe it would hold up better and actually show us the effectiveness of this shotgun slug. So we got one. This is a Ballistic Dummy Lab human torso. We've played with these several times on the channel now and they are absolutely awesome. Easily my favorite thing to test bullets on. So like I said, this is a human torso, but they customized it for me and put blue blood in this one. I like the different colors, but you can see up close just how realistic and anatomically correct these torsos are. As you can see, it's got all the bones and organs and everything you would see in a real human torso. And by the way, if you want to get some Ballistic Dummy Lab stuff for yourself, be sure to use our discount code ONESHOTTV and you can save some money. But this ought to be a really fun video because these torsos always are and shotgun slugs are especially cool. Let's get started. All right, before we hit the torso, I'm going to put one of these on that green steel target to show you what they do and then we'll see how the torso handles it. Spicy slug versus steel target. <laughs> That's why people wanted to see these versus a human torso, because they're freaking awesome. Hey guys, before we go any further, I wanna thank my good friends at EuroOptic.com for sponsoring today's video. EuroOptic.com is a website that I have used for a very long time, way before they were a supporter of the channel, which makes these ads easy for me to do because it's a company that I trust and I have a lot of personal experience with. And my favorite thing about EuroOptic, number one, they're a veteran owned and operated company with a huge inventory and tons of really cool stuff in stock, but their inventory is updated in real time. So if you see something listed as in stock on the website, it's actually in stock and available to buy. Which oddly enough is something you can't say about a lot of other websites and there's nothing more annoying than when you buy something and then get an email afterward saying it's on back order and it's not gonna come for three or four months. It makes me so mad. And on top of that, they also do free same day shipping. As long as you order within normal business hours, of course, they will package it and ship it out that very day. And with their red shipping, they even guarantee one to two day delivery commitments. So the entire process from placing the order on the website to it arriving at your house is like one to three days. You all know that EuroOptic is a big supporter of the channel and I think this video should get a decent amount of eyeballs. So please go check them out and tell them we sent you. And again, a big thank you to EuroOptic.com for sponsoring today's video. Now this slug should probably be the video ender because it's definitely the best slug we have out here today and probably one of the coolest shotgun slugs ever made. But I don't wanna shoot up the torso and mess it all up before we get to this one. So we're gonna shoot it first. There are many different names and variations for this slug. I think these are called the heavy hitter. And like I said, we do have several videos on them. So I'm not gonna go into detail. If you want the full description, go watch those other videos, but they're freaking awesome. Let's see what it does to the torso. I'm gonna try to put it right on the old sternum bone there. Oh! It literally knocked our torso off the stand and I caught a bone fragment to the side of the head. <laughs> wow. Well, that was a first. I've never had the torso get completely blown off the stand like that. So <laughs> that kind of shows you how hard this slug actually hit that thing. And you can see we've got some pieces of it left right there. And then on the bottom, you can see the damage that it did as it was falling off the stand. I honestly think what happened is that PVC pipe is running right up the middle and that's what holds it upright and that slug 
might have just destroyed that thing. So let's flip it over and see what the damage looks like. Had to go get my medical gloves because these things can get kind of messy. But one thing I noticed when it was laying on its stomach is there were zero exit holes on the back of this torso. So that shotgun slug did not pass all the way through, which is very impressive. But you can see the damage that we have on the front of this thing. And this is easily the most impressive result I've ever seen on a torso. It looks like I put that slug right where I was aiming, dead center, and it obliterated that entire rib cage, sternum, just everything that was there. Hopefully you guys can see down in there, it is charred and destroyed pretty much all the way through, and it almost separated the top half from the bottom half. This thing is barely staying together, and you can see over here how close that lung is to completely falling out. Absolutely incredible. But thank goodness we have the slow-mo footage because it's kind of hard to show you how much damage we actually have on this thing. But I've shot these several times with, you know, 50 cals, elephant guns. I've also seen other videos on them. And this has to be easily the most damage I've ever seen from one single round. And my plan was to shoot it with several other shotgun slugs and compare them. But unfortunately, that might be kind of hard to do because there's really nothing left. And as condoms usually do, it looks like it broke and wrapped around the base of the pole. It's not the first time I've seen that. All right, guys, all I can really do is lay it on the table and try to put one more slug through it. It's barely staying together, so this will probably just blow it apart, but we have to shoot at least one more. So this is the Federal Power Shock, a very common hollow point slug. Let's see what it does. Again, it's already heavily compromised, so I don't really know what to expect. And unfortunately, I took the thumbnail with three shotgun slugs in my hand. So I wasn't trying to clickbait you. That was my intention, but let's see what this one does. <laughs> I think I just grazed the top. Yeah, that one went right in the same spot as our first one, so let's try it again. I'm gonna try to put this one on the bottom half of the torso. There we go. And that one went in right there towards the bottom and clearly did quite a bit of damage. It almost blew this piece completely off the table. It looks like we have a lung laying on the ground right there. And I also saw a piece of ballistics gel fly about 20 feet that way. This thing looks like an open cadaver at this point. There's really not much left to look at. And every other shotgun slug compared to the first one seem kind of underwhelming, which is crazy to say because shotgun slugs are extremely powerful. But it looks like the top half is still somewhat intact so let's shoot it one more time all right this is the duplex broadhead expanding steel slug and you can see on the box what they're supposed to do very cool it's been a while since we've shot them and i only got one left so let's see what it does it looks like we're gonna get three slugs after all not the three that i planned on but oh well i'm gonna put this one on the top half right by the arm there since that's the biggest piece of intact ballistics gel Let's see what it does. Nice. All right, so this one actually wound up being cooler and more conclusive than I expected it to be. So you can see where that slug went into the shoulder right there, and you can even see the five different wound cavities where that broadhead expanded and those petals broke off. It created almost a starburst effect, which is exactly what it's supposed to do. So very impressive in that ballistic shell. Hopefully you guys can see that. And I'm not sure how far they penetrated. It doesn't look like most of them came out of this shoulder, but definitely did 
quite a bit of damage. At this point, I feel like we're just beating a dead horse because this torso does not deserve to be disrespected in this way. That first slug was way more impressive than even I was expecting, so. Very cool, but it kind of screwed up my plans for the rest of the video, unfortunately. All right, guys, there you have it. This video perfectly demonstrates why these are my favorite shotgun slugs ever invented, and once again, they have proven themselves. Like I said, the video did not go as I planned because the first one was just so freaking dramatic, but either way, very cool and very impressive. Thank you all for suggesting this video in the comments. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you have any other ideas that you would like to see with these slugs, let me know in the comments to this video because usually you guys have better ideas than me. If you enjoyed this video, please share it for me because that was a $1,000 shotgun slug since it only took one to completely destroy our human torso. I had other plans for it, but unfortunately, that's not gonna happen because there's nothing left and it's completely destroyed. If you liked the video, also let me know down in the comments below and hit that like button for me, guys. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time.